welcome to winter in Kingston. Actually, a couple of days ago, we finished a run of summer days that went right back to uh, Christmas. And it's actually been beautifully warm and calm. And our little village by the lake had become a bit of a summer resort. Actually, the last week of the summer holidays here, we've had cracker summer weather. Beautifully calm and warm during the day and cool nights. This is why we love our little village of Kingston at the, uh, at the southern end of Lake Wakatipu. And it seems like uh, other people are discovering it as well. Since Christmas, the beaches have been lined with sun seekers and jet skis and motorboats, people and beach umbrellas. You'd think we were somewhere in the North Island. So just before this, uh, this new winter weather set in, we decided to head down to the beach take out the kayak for uh, its first outing this summer and it was also a chance for me to try out my new Christmas present. We decided this Christmas to add an action camera to my photographic tools. Given that we're doing a lot of biking and outdoor activities and, uh, and that this channel is about being outdoors, so an action camera seemed essential. Now, the obvious choice would have been something like a GoPro, um, which are well proven and lots of people are using them. We decided to go with the Insta360 X2, this little number here. So this is still an action camera, but what's really special about it is that it captures a 360 degree field of vision. So basically, it captures a whole view of everything around you. So you can actually pull anything out of that whole 360 degree field of view afterwards in post editing to make your videos. So I'm really excited about the possibilities of this camera and uh, especially the fact that it's waterproof and you can even film underwater. So taking it out on the kayak seemed a pretty obvious thing to try. So the way this camera works is you've got, you've actually got two lenses opposite each other. So it's actually taking two 220 degree fields of view and it's stitching them together. So in stitching them together, it actually cuts out an overlapping area. And that's where the other superpower of this camera comes in. It's built to use with a selfie stick. And that's this number here. They call it the invisible selfie stick. It's invisible because when the two fields of view are stitched together, the camera automatically takes the stick out of the image. So you can take pictures of yourself holding the stick and you won't actually see it. You can actually see right round, look at all this. And you might notice, so I'm actually holding the selfie stick, but hopefully you can't see it. All you can see is my hand, which is holding the selfie stick. Amazing, isn't it? Now watch out for this in some of the shots in this video. Elka and Bonnie borrowed some paddle boards and I brought my sea kayak down to the lake. As so often happens, the moment we decided to head down to the beach, the clouds started rolling in, but luckily the calmness and the warmth were still there, so we had a great afternoon on the beach. Hey, if you like this video, you can help my channel by liking, hitting the subscribe button and the bell icon to receive notifications of any new videos that I make.
quick dash, 100 meter dash.